Hello Taurus and welcome to Truth Well Told Tarot. This is Andrea and I'm here to do your January to February 2024 messages from Spirit Reading for the sign of Taurus, Sun, Moon, Rising and Venus. So I hope you're well. As always, the reading won't be for everyone. Take what resonates for you. And these are mainly messages, so just bear that in mind. I say what comes to me. Okay, we have Embrace the Moment. Embrace this day, this very moment. Think positively today and repel those negative thoughts. Try not to judge yourself or others. This may be harder than you think. What is actually happening is that you're changing your energy. Is your first message, Taurus. So let's pull you an animal spirit message. What do we have for Taurus? Thank you. Message for Taurus. January to February 2024. Thank you, Angel Spirits Guides. Message for Taurus. So I've got quite a few cards, but you know, they come out for a reason. We have number 64, Wasp Spirit. Sometimes life stings. We have number 37, Lion Spirit, Be Generous of Spirit. Lion energy is, is generally connected to strength and courage as well. We have number 42, Otter Spirit, You Are Never Alone. And we have number 58, Stag Spirit, Take the Lead. It kind of feels like some kind of seize the day moment. You know, you might well be needing to uh, take action, take the lead, respond to a situation, take control. I mean, it just feels that kind of energy here. Knowing your capability of doing that too. Let's pull you a destiny card. This is the Sacred Destiny Oracle deck. What do we have for Taurus? Thank you, Angel Spirits Guides. Destiny message for Taurus, January to February 2024. We have abundance. Abundance can be energetic. We can feel that sense of fulfillment, contentment within ourselves, with our situation. Feeling that sense of contentment, fulfillment, bounty within ourselves. It can also be very good in terms of money, career, financial areas, abundance. So let's read that out to you. So the picture shows a wildflower wonderland. Everything is blossoming in life, open to receive. Abundance, fulfillment and prosperity are ready to be activated in your life. Life desires you to prosper. You are moving towards an outpouring of money, energy, time or love. Opportunities are limitless. However, you must take action in the direction of your dreams. Don't wait for abundance to fall into your lap. Take steps. Give deeply and fully. Don't hold back. This card reveals that there, this is a great time to make investments. The more you give with a free and open heart, the more you will receive. Be grateful for what you already have and more will flow to you. Okay, Taurus, let's pull some cards. What do we have as a message from Spirit for Taurus or messages? What do we have for Taurus? Thank you. January to February 2024. What do we have for Taurus? So we have the Four of Wands. Can be quite a celebratory energy. Home, family, relationship, property. Or things that might affect that. Four Corners of Stability and Security. 
we have the Page of Cups. Knight of Swords, bottom of the deck. The Nine of Pentacles, which is a very abundant energy. Taurus, I mean, these are all very positive cards. So certainly in this kind of like a scenario, certainly as far as the tarot concern, is concerned, these are all very kind of like positive. Whatever, is, whatever point you're at right now, it feels very positive energy coming your way. So the Four of Wands can be that sense of stability and security. It can be financial as well, especially with the Nine of Pentacles. And again, in money areas. The energies of the Knight of Swords and the Page of Cups, this can actually be messages of encouragement, support. Page of Cups for me as a reader can also be sometimes something coming in as a bit of a surprise. It's a nice surprise. I mean, it's a very happy surprise, this. Can link with the beginnings of something new, the beginnings of change. There is just a sense of, of happy surprises, happy occasion here. With the Knight of Swords, uh, again, very positive in terms of uh, things moving forward very quickly, uh, things becoming clear in terms of how you're moving forward, positive shifts, progress, uh, very good also in terms of conversations and communication happening, but it feels like in a very positive way. Now, when we talk about the Nine of Pentacles here, Taurus, this is abundance. This can be financial abundance. Um, but you also feel in yourself that you're reaping the fruits of your labor. The Nine of Pentacles is really that feeling of standing on your own two feet in your own abundance because you've worked to achieve that. Whether it's your own business, whether it's a family business or a relationship business here, uh, could well be even some kind of positive news coming in that brings greater abundance or that feeling that you are reaping the fruits of your labor. You are getting financial success, achievement, getting to, I feel the place that you want to be. So this is the energy here of, of just feeling that sense of real sense of abundance, financial success, things coming to uh, fruition in a very positive way financially for you. So these energies are very celebratory, very celebratory in terms of money in particular. Especially up until this point, if you had, you know, even been supported by family or by your other half relationship, for example, as well. Now, interestingly enough, the additional message that I was getting here, Taurus, if you were even financially supporting a child, the same message applies. It might well be somebody who is very close to you. There are that sense of celebration and greater stability and security coming your way because news is coming in for a child, uh, certainly in terms of abundance, reaping the fruits of their labor. That's definitely something that's coming to me. So I feel that that's significant. And again, the same message I feel it might well be something turns up or something um, is presented to you. And this is where you are just saying, I'm going for it. I'm doing it. This is that sense of carpe diem, seize the moment. So just be aware of that. There is absolutely a need. Again, embrace the moment, take the lead because you're meant to. You're not alone on this journey, but you're meant to take the lead. You're meant to go for it. You know, you're meant to you know, go full throttle towards it. This just feels that kind of energy, certainly in terms of money, career, finances, because it feels there is just this energy of, of positive celebrations, outcomes, stability, security coming your way. So lovely energy on that basis. Now, Taurus, again, this energy of life stings, it might well be coming to this point that's the energy that you, again, could be a young person, may have experienced. So maybe financially, for others of you, if something has gone on with sometimes life stings in relationship terms, the Page of Cups is a message from the heart. Now, it can be from a child or a young person. It can also be a message from, you know, somebody who is closely connected to you, a family member, um can be, you know, love romance. 
So there could be some kind of very positive message here. Could even be things like proposals, engagements. Um, it just feels like linked with this, this is progress. This is moving forward. This is positive shifts. Um, you know, kind of like, let's do it. Let's move in that direction. It could even be to do with home and property or moving home or property, even with the four of wands. But this just feels, let's do it. Let's move forward. Let's go for that. That communication happening here. Because... This is about somebody and just feeling that sense of fulfillment and contentment. Um, that's what I'm getting here. You know, if you've whatever you've been through could be in the past, could be, you know, way in the past. This just is the feeling here. Now is the time to take the lead and move forward in a relationship. It could also be apologies, heartfelt gestures as well with the page of cups. The same message really applies, you know being treated as you deserve and nothing less than that. And there's real promise in terms of how you're moving forward, maybe some kind of communication on that basis, you know, so this just feels like a very, very positive energy. Whatever has come, whatever has come to pass up until this point, it feels like things are about to get so much better, you know, but it does feel like it involves taking the lead and I'm moving forward in a clear direction, very positive shifts, but very good in terms of stability, security, celebrations, engagements, marriage, home, family, property. This is the focus here, is what I'm getting. And sometimes we, we realize who's important to us, especially if you've been going through a difficult time, say for example, financially say you've been supported financially, you know, and you feel that now you're, you're reaping the fruits of your labor again. This is when we realize who is important to us in our life, you know, when we go through tough times, when we realize who our friends are, who we can lean on for support, this can be the energy here. Because there is that sense you're never alone, somebody else is in it with you. And the additional message here is that people who you've lost from the other side are also watching over in this energy because that's the four of one's energy. Um, it can represent the connection of people that you've lost to the other side, to the other side, still watching over you, you know, so very powerful energy here. Yeah, I mean, you could get very spiritual with these energies too. Especially if you're... If you're moving forward with something on an intuit... Because intuitively you feel you need to. Again, the same message applies. You could be watched over here. This sense of... Maybe, you know, people who you've lost to the other side are helping you in some way, inspiring you through your intuition, you know. All right, let's pull you a guardian angel message. What do we have? To, I'm going to choose these cards because they don't tend to fall out easily, but we will see. What do we have for Taurus? Thank you, Angel Spirits Guides. Message for Taurus. I've got two. So let's see what we have. We have Rainbow. You are a jewel even though you may not see it. Even in the darkest times, you shine eternally bright. You are surrounded by an aura of love and a pot of gold awaits beyond the horizon. All will clear soon. Trust and continue to follow your dreams. You are eternally blessed. With that, we have creativity. We, your angelic messages, are messengers, are here to help unleash the endless creative potential that you possess. Listen to the whispers of love inside your heart as we communicate with you through feeling and emotion. Let go of fear and apprehension and express the endless source of creativity you possess. 
Have fun and allow the inner child within you to express your true essence. All is valid. All right, Taurus. Let's see what we have as a final message. Final message for Taurus. Thank you, Angel Spirits Guides. Final message for Taurus. We have let us hug you. Close your eyes as we hold you close. Number 30. We have listened to your inner voice as we try to guide you. Use your intuition. Number 21. That's what I have for you, Taurus, for the next couple of months. I hope you enjoyed your reading. If you did, please do like, share and subscribe. I wish you a wonderful next two months and I will see you next time.